What's up everybody, it's AJ with eTrader.com. Today we're gonna to be checking out the Serco lawn chair holder. It's gonna go on your ladder on the back of your rig or even your van. You can attach it on there and then you can hang up your chairs, strap them down, and you have to find space for them in the basement doors or in the inside. Let's check it out. Taking a look at the arms themselves, they're gonna be made out of a heavy duty aluminum. They're even rubberized here on the portions where the chair sits, so you don't have to worry about them getting scuffed up and it just helps better grip. You can see me pushing back and forth. They're not easily moving anywhere. So we only have two chairs on here right now, but can hold a total of six and has a weight capacity of 50 pounds. So just make sure you don't exceed that. So there are some things to think about when you are gonna hang your chairs up here, where you're gonna mount the arms. You do want them up and out of the way of your bumper. If you had one down here, we don't hear. Luckily, our ladder is in the center, but another thing to look out for is if your ladder is more towards the side, you wouldn't wanna cover up the tail lights either. We have the straps up here up top, really easy to run those through, pull them tight to keep the chairs in place. Another thing to help them just not move back and forth a whole lot. We're gonna remove the chairs to take a better look at the arms themselves. The strap, you just pull back on a little bit, feed it back through and remove it. When they're not in use, you can just put the strap back through the buckle. Now we are mounting these to the ladder. We don't want the ladder unusable because you might need to get to the roof sometime. So you have the pins up here up top. You just pull that out. And then you can turn the arm to the side. That way they're out of the way and you can go all the way up the ladder. One thing we did notice is on this side, this bottom portion wasn't quite big enough for the pin. So maybe recommend getting a drill and drill out just a little bit more so it can slide back down. The other side worked just fine. Make sure you only put chairs on here. Lawn chairs is what it's rated for. Again, the weight capacity is only 50 pounds. You can hold six chairs, so just keep it around there. You don't want to overload this and cause any issues. Now we've talked about what it is and what it's for. Let's talk about how the install. It's not too bad, depending on where you want to put this on the ladder. You have some brackets that screw in from the back. Check out how I did it. Starting the install, I've already installed some of the brackets. You're gonna have to hold up the arm and get that. You're gonna have the back bracket that goes on. It's not threaded, but this portion at the front is threaded. So we're gonna show you on this one over here. Hold into place. It comes with the Allen wrench that you need to do this. I'm just gonna get it hand tight so I don't have to hold it the whole time. We'll get that one started and we'll do the other one on the other side. It comes with the Allen wrench you need to tighten them down. I would try and do it evenly. You don't want to tighten one side down all the way. So just go back and forth until it gets on there tight. Now, once you want to set it up, you can either leave it, the arm to the side. That way it's out of the way. You can access the lighter and climb up or you can get it ready for the chairs. You just line up this slot with the hole in the side and then throw your chair up there. Overall, I think it's a good idea to add to your rigs just to carry some extra chairs that you wouldn't be able to fit in the basement or inside. Now, this one is the Serco one compared to the Stronger Carlson one. That one only holds four chairs and the insulation is a little more difficult in that one just because it has bolts and nuts that you have to run through. So this one, you do have to hold that bracket in place, but it's easier to have that one threaded side than trying to fit a nut on there too. I think that's about it though. Thanks for hanging out and hope this helped.